Hi everyone, my name is Eric and this is another video to help you achieve your rendering and movie making goals with Dragonfly. Today we will talk about using multi ROIs in your images and movies. In this video we will assume that you already know how to generate multi ROIs through the different analysis tools and plugins. We will focus mainly on how to display them properly in 3D. So here we have an industrial park dataset in which the porosities have been segmented in the form of a multi-ROI. As you've seen before, the first thing we do is adjust the window leveling, and we will apply the grayscale solid 3D preset. I will click on the eye and 3D icon to show the multi-ROI. And if we clip inside the dataset, I can see the multi ROI lying inside. I will then select the multi ROI object in the list in order to show its properties. Then, scrolling down, I can adjust the diffuse and specular values by using the sliders. To have a better understanding of the position and distribution of the porosities inside the dataset, I will reset the clip box of the dataset and instead I will use the edge contrast option and by using the slider I will adjust the edge threshold and I will use the lighting sliders to make the edges brighter. Then adjusting the diffuse and specular again. I'm now ready to export some images. It's possible to use the edge contrast effect on a sub region of the dataset. So I will disable the global edge contrast effect and in the clip panel I will show the clip box and clip inside. And now instead of clipping what's outside, at the bottom of the clip panel I can select from several visual effects. I will uncheck the clip and select edge contrast. And by selecting the edge contrast in the list of live effects I can use the slider to adjust the threshold. 